I'm a new soul. I came to this strange world, hoping I could learn a bit about how to give and take. But since I came here, felt the joy and the fear, finding myself making every possible mistake. Because month. Cammie did something wonderful to her computer. <laughs> Due to an unfortunate series of events. <laughs> unfortunate series of events caused by Cammie. <laughs> I kind of um, killed her my computer. computer. <laughs> it's okay now. Mackie's alright. But that's why we haven't had any video updates. My eyes are all watering. No. Okay, this is an awesome angle. <laughs> my arm's gonna get tired. We went to Jerusalem. Wait, hold on, my eyes feel like... <laughs> I went to Jerusalem and isn't feel like joining this update. You okay now? I think so. Sorry. We went to Jerusalem. Shalom from Yushalayim. It's 12 o'clock. Do you hear the church bells? And we're in a really cool back alley. We don't really know where we are. And we don't know where we're going, but that's okay. We're gonna go over here. I just want to show you some of Jerusalem. Um. It's been an adventure coming here. It all kind of looks like this. But we're hoping so, we can find our hostel, but we're not sure where it is. Okay. This is where we're attempting to go. Yes, and we're somewhere. We're on Arat. Oh, it should be just on the corner. We slept on the roof of a hostel. Here we are. This is our lovely sleeping accommodations for tonight. On top of a roof. It's pretty awesome. If you listen, you can hear the call to prayer right now. Let's take a panoramic shot. Dome of the Rock right there. Um, I think we made a good choice. I'm thinking, yeah. I was like, huh, I wonder if staying on a roof would be fun. I hope it is. <laughs> and we talked to some Israeli kids. And they were pretty cool. And we went to the Kotel. And that was pretty cool. Hello. We are at the Wailing Wall, or Western Wall. Or there's one more name for it that I can't remember. The Kotel. The Kotel, yes. In Hebrew. Yes. I think I'm saying that wrong. But here it is. You can see it is very cool. And we're going to stay for service, I think. I've never been to a Shabbat service before. It's Shabbat, by the way. It is what's considered to be the site of Jesus' crucifixion. And... Yeah, no, we should actually find that place. I don't know where that is. That's it's over, kind of that's like, where we said that, up those little stairs that everyone was crying right, by. Of course. Uh, this is a pillar, or what used to be a pillar. Apparently, this is an interdenominational church, but the denominations tend to fight over which... Over who gets to change the light bulb. <laughs> and we had... Tasty food. And it tasted pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> and so we're trying to get Anna to buy a scared for 250 shekels. Which is a lot, by the way. We are now about to leave Jerusalem. We are just outside of the old city. See, there it is. It was an excellent, awesome first trip, and hopefully we'll have another trip for you soon with maybe more of the markets and more, more of us stuff, doing yeah. stuff. This is our first time, so we didn't really know what to expect. It is an amazing place. All the prayer seems to have ended and the church bells seem to have ended. They tend to go off at the same time. This morning, it was wonderful. Break of dawn. It's still dark. There's just the slightest bit of pink in the horizon. It's, so it's like 5.30 in the morning. There, you hear the call of prayer. Okay? And it's all well and good. And then the call of prayer just ending and then the church bells go off. And then, <laughs> and then there was a, like a, a five or ten minute break and then they did it again. Yeah, then it, there was more. And I was just like, ugh. But actually, like as the sun came up, like I just buried in my sleeping bag more. And I woke up at like nine and I was like, oh crap, it's bright out here. But like I hadn't even noticed because I had just buried my head in my sleeping mm -hmm. bag and it was warm and toasty in there. Sleeping on a roof, not as bad as you would think it would no. be. So that roof right over there is where we slept tonight. We are currently on the rooftop. And this is where we're sleeping tonight. This is the book that has been our 
our guides everywhere. Yep. So if you're going somewhere, strongly recommend it. It's nice. We walk through a lot of little winding little narrow street alley things that have all these shops all along the side and all of you can't stop to look at anything unless you really want to because then the shop says, Hello, how can I take your money? <laughs> oh, I'm tired. I know. But it's been a good day. It has been. Like amazing. Please come to Jerusalem if you ever get the chance. So here's the end tally on Jerusalem, okay? Hotel, or hostel, decent. Tour guide, not creepy. Hard to find, um, <laughs> surprisingly. And city, generally awesome. Five stars, so yeah. yeah. Okay. If you're ever in the vicinity. Yes, you should come. It's awesome. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> we also bought a guitar, oh my gosh! It's wonderful! Show you. Oh, it was 260 shekels. Only 10 shekels more than the skirt that <laughs> they wanted me to pay for. Which is kind of ridiculous. Which is like $70, but it is actually a pretty nice one. This is really out of tune. Anyway! So that's uh, our guitar. We went to the beach, and there's monstrous jellyfish that wash up on shore. We tried to touch them. Look at this. <laughs> we were a little bit afraid of getting shocked because sometimes apparently they can sting you when they're dead, but we only touched the top. Like, like finding, finding Nemo. Nemo. <laughs> Of advice. So we touched the tops. They were okay. And they kind of felt weird. It felt kind of like rubber. What else have we done? Um, classes started. We have a two-week period of trying out different classes. So we've been going to like every single class and then we get to choose which ones we want. We're yeah. trying to avoid ones with lots of work. <laughs> Not because we're lazy, but because, but because we want to be able to go and see stuff and do stuff and show you wonderful stuff. Coming up in the near future, we are going on a four, four, three day hike, three, four, day hike four day hike to a lot, which is in the south, and that's going to be like crazy hot and like sleeping and the desert. And <laughs> it'll be cool. It'll be awesome. <laughs> There's something else you're going to talk about. Oh, we have a cat friend. His name is Solomon. And he made friends with one. Actually, I Rebecca and tolerate I tolerate its presence. Anne does not like it, but it's okay because you only live once, and who doesn't want a cat friend? Mm -hmm.